tonight is a singer who proves that looking like a 13-year-old boy doesn't stop you being a success on Britain's Got Talent. Let's be honest, looking like a 13-year-old boy doesn't stop you presenting Britain's Got Talent. Yeah, yeah, yeah. What? Nothing. It's Care James. I'm Care James. I'm 13 years old and I'm a singer from Glasgow. I live with my mum, my dad and my sister. I've always loved music and I started busking about a year ago. When you go out, everyone's so supportive. If someone stops, it's like a good compliment because they don't have to. My family's all kind of really supportive, especially my mum and dad. They take me everywhere to every gig. The first edition has changed my life. The judges' reaction was amazing and I honestly didn't think I was going to get the comments I did. You came out with this real energy, real optimism, and you're good when you're different and you're good when you stand out. I've watched Britain's Got Talent since I was a wee boy, so it's a dream to be here. It would be absolutely amazing to perform in front of the royal family. You don't get a chance to perform in front of them every day, <laughs> especially Megan. I like her. Oh, I hope she doesn't see this. <laughs> when I perform, it's like no one's watching. Sometimes I kind of just get lost in it, especially a song I connect to. I'm going to put everything I've got into the performance because this is the biggest opportunity of my life. My burdens last night pre flight. Zero hour, 9 a.m. And I'm gonna be high as a kite by then. And I think it's gonna be a long, long time to touch down. I'm not the man they think I am at home oh, no, no, no I'm a rockin' man Oh, rockin' man Burning out his shoes out here and gone Mom's in the kind of place To raise your kids Fame is cold as hell Rockin' me choice of song you have so much charisma so much charm I mean you brought the house down literally <laughs> if I was gonna give you one tiny bit of what I think is constructive criticism just watch your diction because every now and then I mean sometimes you can't understand what Elton John's singing either to be fair but sometimes I just lost some of the words and I just would like to hear them a bit more clearly but that is it it was a great audition <laughs> This is so much better than your first audition, I cannot tell you, really. I think this is what I call a bit of a marmite, you know, love or hate. I think you are sort of discovering your voice. You're 14, right? 
So I think I know where it's going to end up. You have a beautiful tone. Um, but it, what I loved about this audition was we've had a lot of kids your age come on. There's kids. Boys your age come on and they do something really obvious and I've seen it or heard it before. This to me felt different. It really felt like you'd actually written the song. Very good. That is a massive song for anyone to take on. Especially for one uh, so young as you, and you won. That was incredible. Well done. Such a clever song choice. It's very of the moment, and it's lovely to see you step up from the auditions and play in the piano. Fantastic. I love the tone of your voice. Did you say you're 13, not 14? Yeah. No, he's 13. Yeah. That is so impressive. Thank Honestly. You. Just well done. You did Thank so you. well. Thank Thank you. You. Thank you. We were talking earlier. And isn't this show the reason why you started singing anyway? Yeah, uh -huh. I started watching the Susan Boyle first edition when uh -huh. I was about three, and I've always kind of sang, so... Um... Well, I feel all... <laughs> How old were you when you saw Susan Boyle? When you were three. Well, three. Since, since I remember, the show started when I was... Three. I wasn't alive. Oh, wowzers. <laughs> <laughs> um, How good did that feel? It was absolutely phenomenal. Thank you very much for this point. If you want to see Care singing in the show on, fi on the final on Sunday, follow the details on screen, but not until we've seen the last act of the night. One more time, Care J.